Where did the love of reptiles come from at? Uh, uh, well, shoot. Just at a young age, um, I think it was like third grade, I read a book. That was my first love for reptiles. I got me a turtle, and then from there, I grew to like snakes, lizards. Snakes jump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So really, it started from from a book that uh, we read like in third grade. So. What's your favorite pet of all time? Um, that you had or you want? Probably my snake. Uh, probably like the tree boa that I had. Um, tree boa? Yeah, tree boa. Um, but uh, yeah, I just recently got a dog though, so I've been taking taking yeah, care a dog, a dog. So yeah, I've been taking care of him a lot more because he's been yeah, you know. So what kind? The XL bully, American bully. You ever get the crocodile pond? Oh no, not yet, not yet. It's in the hopefully it's in the works soon. In the works. Uh, in the works. <laughs> uh, take me through your interception. What was, um, that? What was the play? Um, yeah, so really I was just trying to read the quarterback's eyes. Um, you know, staying on top, um, going with the flow. Um, and as soon as, uh, as soon as soon as I saw him break out uh, the pocket, um, I was mirroring him, and then uh, he just you know overthrew the ball, and I was right there to grab it. So, what about TCU interested you the most? I must say, really Rock. just yeah, really just the uh, the small town feel kind of like it reminded me of home. Um, but it was also just big time football, you know, big time atmosphere in that in that aspect. Um, and then I just love you know what Coach P brought to the table. I love co what Coach G brought to the table. Um, just really good mentors of, of how they coach uh, football and then just, you know, just how to be a man and handle your business. So, right. yeah. Have you uh, other off-field interests besides the reptiles? Like, what do you do? Man, um, so I like, I just started picking up golfing. Oh, you golfing? Yeah, yeah, a little bit. Not a golfer golfer. I just started picking it up, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so um, I like to go, like, uh, snowboarding. Um, three gun competition. I did a three gun, three gun competition a couple years back. Still doing stuff with like going to the range, grilling, cooking, stuff like that. Just stay active, you know. Kind of like during my my first off season, I picked up a lot of Away. different hobbies. Just my first off season. You just picked up a bunch just of picked up some hobbies just to stay active, you know. Just not sit at home. Ever bitten or scared of one of the animals? Someone was Ever bitten by or scared of one of the animals? Uh, my actually my turtle, my, the first turtle I got bit me, and that was the first time I ever got bit by. I think my first and last time, none of my other animals bit me, but that one hurt. Now it because it it has a beak on it, you know what I'm saying? So it kind of just boom, it was really quick. So it got me, and it hung on. So like I I had my hand out, it hung on. I could let it go, it just just hang. So I had to hanging. I had to pull it off. And, yeah, it was not it was not for so. never any of the snakes. You walked no. around with snakes your whole life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, they they don't have it bit me. What have you learned most about the NFL being with the Raiders? What have you learned most about? The NFL? Um, man, that you know it's a business. Um, you know, um, you just got to be on top of your game every second. You know, meeting rooms, practice, games, uh, just how you carry yourself. Um, you know. Like I said, it's, it's, it's a business, and you got to treat it as such. And um, but still, I found like find time to have fun. You know, enjoy the guys, enjoy the moments that you have. And uh, because sometimes you know they don't last long, or you might be somewhere else. So I know it's a long way away, but have you thought of post NFL plans? Um, I'd like to stay in sports somehow, whether that be like you know sports broadcasting. Um, you know, marketing, coaching, anything coaching, like that. Yeah, coach? yeah. I mean. It's easy to say now, but just anything in the in the sports world, I'd like to be in. You know, who is that you do the most? Um, probably my mom. Just how hard she works. Um, you know, her dedication and just always wanting the best for me. Um, you know, I really, I really love that about her, and that, and that pushes me every day. You know, what I'm saying it's one of the reasons why the, the main reason why I got here is because of her. So. Did any anyone influence you in football? Probably my coaches, Coach P, Coach G. Um, my high school coach, Coach Hill, um, a lot of those guys were my mentors growing up. Um, you know, played a big role in just, especially how I handled myself off the field. Right. Um, you know, they were really big mentors in that aspect, but also in football too.